So my name is Ari Perez and I'm uh, currently the Vice President of the Business Development Department of the Basis Conversion and Development Authority. So currently, uh, we have this uh, Clark Special Economic Zone where we have what we call a main zone and part of that is uh, already being um, operated by an integrated operations center although right now it is uh, purely focused on security and safety but that system we would like to uh, progress into something that uh, would include the other industries such as uh, health um, traffic management, um, uh, facilities management, so all the gamut of uh, being a smart city. And of course, we have this Clark Green City project where it's just that near from that main zone of the Clark Special Economic Zone. It is a 9,450 ma uh, master plan metropolis, which uh, we envision to be a smart, green and disaster resilient metropolis so uh, first of that is that uh, being smart would mean that we will introduce a, a citywide uh, network infrastructure where it would manage everything from uh, public safety and security traffic uh, environment facility management and public information so we are open to partnering uh, with uh, investors who, will, who would like to do this together with us because Clark Green City is in its uh, initial stages so probably we'll focus more on developing at least a parcel of uh, that Clark Green City and put a uh, showcase uh, smart, uh, smart system in that uh, first parcel. Uh, of course it's uh, in the Philippines as a smart city there, you, it's hard to find a model for a smart city and we believe that uh, we are pioneering in this uh, endeavor so we have to learn from scratch basically uh, we are not that very technical people because our uh, our expertise is more on real estate now we are trying to incorporate this uh, software and hardware into running uh, uh, a, a city so the challenges that we are faced with is trying to understand how to immediately implement these kinds of systems in uh, building a metropolis what we're looking for are investors and not suppliers who have these kinds of products about uh, uh, the, the whole thing about the smart, being a smart city from the hardware to software. So we're, what we're looking for is someone who would, uh, who are we, who's willing to take the risk with us in building a city that is uh, very greenfield. For us to make this happen is that uh, we need the support of the private sector. So of course we have to balance um, uh, profitability and the mandate of the BCDA as a, a, a catalyst for economic development. So we have to balance these things and together there's uh, plenty of opportunities with uh, working in a, in, a, in, a new, in a new city because you have everything there. And it is a very large space, so a very large area with 9,450. So there's room for everyone. And with that largeness of space, we also require the help of the private sector in uh, trying to fill in the, the different aspects of the uh, of, of city. Yeah. For me, because it is my, yeah, it is my first, and actually I've learned a lot. A lot. Uh, there's some uh, speakers who basically gave like a crash course on what is Internet of Things, and then you see from best practices in other countries, such as the one presented by, uh, for the Yokohama city in, in Japan, and then there's Thailand as well. So it's a good experience for us to be in these forums, to be in this conference, to be able to understand, uh, what, to be able to understand how to implement uh, smart cities.